Hey gang, I hope everyone's having an awesome day. I support the way anyone would like to eat, vegan, vegetarian, carnivore, otherwise, as long as it's done properly for optimal health. One of the biggest factors is biochemical individuality. This means that your body metabolizes foods differently than anybody else's body. Your body is constantly getting rid of old cells, creating new cells. We want the new cell to be like very structurally sound, thick walls, really difficult for this cell to be invaded by a free radical, which is anything that can damage or kill a cell. We need complete protein in our diets. When we have all nine essential amino acids in the right quantity for our bodies, we end up with very well structured new cells. We pair these with healthy fats and healthy carbohydrates and your body then has everything that it needs to have to make you optimally healthy. Let's go over my favorite breakfast. Grains aren't necessarily the healthiest thing for us to eat. Certain grains are much healthier than others. Let's talk about the almighty oat. This is my favorite well-rounded breakfast. I'm gonna take you through it. Now your body would have its own amount of protein that you would need, its own amount of healthy carbs, its own amount of healthy fats, and your body would also have a language. Our bodies give us very clear signs and signals from one to three hours after we eat anything. So learning the language of your body and what your body thrives best on is absolutely ideal. But let's talk about a breakfast that would be wonderful for most people. I say most people because I do add an egg. Some people can't have eggs. I do add oats. Some people don't do well with grains. It is best to make sure that they are wheat or gluten free. Every time oats are processed in a facility that also contains wheat or gluten, they are definitely contaminated. This is my favorite brand. It's called Bob's Red Milk. Yes, it's a little pricier, but you know that it's going to be much better for your gut. That's worth the cost. One very quick note about organic foods. Organic foods are very important. A lot of people talk about how they're so expensive. I get it. I made a YouTube video on the absolute best way to eat optimally healthy in the least expensive way possible. If you are eating organic food, it is so nutrient dense that your body will need 30 to 60% less food than it used to. Okay, let's get into this delicious breakfast. Okay, here we are in the kitchen. I'm gonna take you through all of my ingredients. One thing that's very important to know is that the food we eat directly relates to brain function. The gut-brain connection is so much more important than a lot of people realize. The brain uses tons of energy compared to the rest of the body. So it's really important to fuel your brain with foods that help it combat stress and damage, which is exactly what this powerhouse breakfast is gonna do. Green apples, they are the lowest on the sugar scale when it comes to apples. Super high in vitamin C, great for the immune system. They reduce the risk of heart attack or stroke, fight cancers, good source of fiber and vitamins, high in potassium, and they help you feel full. Next, we've got the humble egg. Make sure you're going free range with eggs, free range means that the chicken is out there running around able to eat what it's intended to eat which makes the egg healthier for you in the end. Berries can help guard the brain against damage and improve long-term function. Older adults who ate the most blueberries and strawberries had the slowest rates of cognitive decline. Raspberries are an excellent natural probiotic. Berries can help delay cognitive aging by up to two and a half years. These are very potent free radical scavengers. They're also very seriously going to help protect against the effects of oxidative stress and inflammation in the body. The brain really needs certain chemicals to protect itself. When our diets don't reflect that is where diseases usually start. This is a very gut healthy meal as well. It helps get rid of candida overgrowth that's already there and this creates an inhospitable environment for parasites which are a lot more common than most people think. Next we've got my favorite two spices for oatmeal, cinnamon and nutmeg. Oh and let's not forget cumin. Make sure that your spices are all organic. Non-organic spices go through a process called irradiation, which renders them as good food for the gut bacteria that we want to starve out and keep at a healthy level. Our friend Cinnamon has been shown to help regulate blood sugar levels and improve our heart health, while its buddy Nutmeg is a great source of antioxidants which can help protect our bodies against disease. Both also have anti-inflammatory properties, which obviously will help remove inflammation in the body. Third wheel over here, cumin, contains antioxidants, has anti 
anti cancer properties, helps control blood sugar, fights bacteria and parasites, has an anti inflammatory effect, may help lower cholesterol, and aids in weight loss. You can add it to anything, and it works to help prevent fat accumulation in the body and to get rid of fat. One of my absolute favorite ingredients almond butter. You want to make sure that your almond butter contains just almonds. I've seen a lot that contain things like cane sugar and other additives we don't need in almond butter. It's a good idea to steer clear of peanuts and cashews, especially if you're concerned with your gut health. Peanuts and cashews and also pistachios tend to grow a type of mold in between the nut and the shell that can contribute to harmful gut bacteria overgrowth. Almond butter is super high in monounsaturated fats, which helps lower bad cholesterol and raise good cholesterol. Many other properties in almond butter also help improve heart health and it's chock full of healthy fat. Nuts like walnuts are rich in vitamin E, which is known for its brain protective quality. Pack the most ALA, which is a type of omega-3 fatty acid than any other nut. They also have higher levels of polyphenolic compounds, which is a type of antioxidant. Both compounds help lower oxidative stress and inflammation, which are two causes of serious cognitive decline. Pumpkin seeds are one of the only nutritional sources that are both healthy fats and complete protein in one. I like it to be creamier, so I like to use almond milk. Unsweetened helps keep the gut in check. It still tastes great. This brand also does not contain carrageenan. Carrageenan is a hormonal disruptor. It's terrible for us. It's found in a lot of dairy-free products. Please steer clear. Excess glucose can be very detrimental to the brain. Maintaining steady glucose or blood sugar balance is essential to our overall health. I would stick with rolled oats or even oat groats instead of quick cook. Quick cook oats digest very quickly. They turn into glucose much more quickly. Heart health is so interconnected with brain health. There is a serious heart brain connection that I will be talking way more about on this channel. Your heart sends blood through vessels all over the body, including the brain and damage to those vessels leads to serious health conditions. So oats or overnight oats containing blueberries, walnuts, and all the other things we spoke about are going to keep you happy and healthy. Enough chatter. Let's get on to actually cooking this. Half a cup of oats, half a cup of almond milk, and half a cup of water. Put it on high heat and we stir. It's good to have your apple chopped ahead of time because when you put it into the oats as they're cooking, you get a really apple pie type of vibe. Right about now is when you wanna be putting the egg in. Turn it down a little. Stir as the oats are cooking. You'd never know it was there, and it lends a really nice texture to the oats as well. Moments later. Let's put this all together. This is what we've ended up with, and it's also cleanse friendly. If you've been following me for a while, you know that I often do a total gut overhaul. I love cleaning out my gut. It's so important. You can get rid of IBS, psoriasis, eczema, mood disorders, brain fog. The list is endless. If you thought this video was helpful, informative, or entertaining at all, please give it a thumbs up down there for me. And if you want notifications of when future videos are coming down the line, hit that notification bell down there and you will be sent a notification each time I upload. Please subscribe. Subscribing is really where the support comes from for all of us creators here on YouTube and it's free. There's a lot of videos coming down the line in the future. I'm gearing up for a Q&A. So if you have any questions, let me know. I'd be happy to answer them. Onwards and upwards always, like I always say, have super amounts of fun in your life and have super amounts of fun nourishing your body so that we can experience the best life we possibly can. See you next time, guys. Bye.